Hey boys and girls, in today's video we're going to talk about density. And density is the amount of matter in an object, simply put. Or if an object is heavy and small, it has a lot of density. Now in today's video we're going to be using water for our experiment. We have our objects right there. Alright, so we have different objects here. Um, I have a cork, I have some rubber, I have sponge, wood, plastic, metal. I have a rock as well. This is a rock. So these are going to be the objects that we're going to be using. Okay, so at this time, go ahead and make your predictions. Write down in your journal the chart, your predictions, what you think that is going to happen. And let's start off with the rock. Now with the rock, do you think it's going to be more dense than the water or less dense than water? Let's go ahead and test it out. Three, two, one. Okay, so that sank, the rock sank, therefore it is more dense than water. All right, so I'm gonna take it out, take the rock out. I have it right here, put it in my tray. And let's get another item. This time I'm going to use the sponge. What do you think it's, is it, you think is it gonna float or is it going to sink? Three, two, one. Uh-oh, all right, now let's push it down. And it comes right back up, so that is going to float. Squeeze it out. Let's try the wood. What do you guys think? Three, two, one. Push it in, push it in, it comes back up. Let's try the cork. Cork floats. Let's try the metal ball. Uh-oh, that one sinks. Let's try the plastic spoon. You gotta push it in. It looks like it's going to be floating. Let's take these objects out. There we go. Right, just to speed up the process, I'm gonna add a few more at a time. Now this is a cork. This is made out of rubber, sank, Marble, made out of glass, sank. Now the cork comes from the cork tree. Um, this is cork. Uh, the golf ball, I think this is a tee, a tee golf, or I'm not sure what this one's called. It's made out of wood. Oop, that one. So we kind of know that wood is going to what? Wood's going to float. I'm trying to push it down. All right, last three things. We have a cube, plastic cube used in math. Push it down. Floats. We have an eraser. Sinks. And we have a pinto bean. Well, lima bean, sorry. It's a lima bean. That one sinks. Put all the things back in there. That one's wood. This is the cork. That one back in there, the spoon, the spoon also floats, the rock sinks, the sponge, the sponge floats, and then the metal ball also sinks. Okay, so I have my two trays. Now we're gonna separate them. This one, no, this one what? Floats. So it's going to be less dense. This is less dense than water, so it's going to float, spoon. Popsicle stick, wood, cube, tea, and then the rest of the things. These are going to the rock, metal ball. Check these out, the marble. And these are also going to. Now in here I have uh, oil and we have water on the bottom. Now why is oil on top and water on the bottom? Oil has less density than water, therefore water is going to sink and oil is going to float. It's gonna float on top of the water. Now, they do not mix because of the properties of oil and water, they will not mix. In this tube, I have styrofoam balls and I have oil. Now the styrofoam balls are going to float 
and the oil is going to sink. It's on the bottom. That means that the styrofoam balls are going to be less dense than oil. And you can conclude that the styrofoam balls are going to float in water since they float in oil. Because oil floats in water. Now, just for the sake of science and for making it entertaining, I have some slime here. It's pretty old slime. Ah! I don't know if the slime is going to sink or float. It's really sticky. Oh, it looks like it's... Eee! This slime is pretty old and it's really sticky. It looks like it's sinking. It's really interesting. I've never put slime in the water. This is, I'm going to dip my hand in here and see what happens. Oh my gosh. Okay, so it looks like it's uh, going to push it down. It looks like some of it's sinking and some of it's floating. I think I might have to add more to it. All right, so five minutes have passed by. It looks like the slime sinks. There's some of it that's floating, but most of it is going to be sinking. Interesting. So we're gonna put slime, that's sinking. All right, boys and girls, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like and subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos coming up about science. Bye, guys.